by Yurjin Ho, Arsenal is ready to win. The £10 million price tag is not too high for a Premier League deal. In return, Arsenal will own the leading midfielder who regulates the play. It can be said that the Yurjin Ho deal is the preparation of the Gunners in the championship race. After the failure in the Moises Cachado deal, Arsenal immediately owned Yurjin Ho. That does not mean that the Italian midfielder is just a firefighter at the Emirates. Instead, this is a deal that shows the ambition of the London team. Last week, coach Mikel Arteta emphasized, we need to recruit one more midfielder. That statement came in the context of Mohamed El Nini's injury, and Albert Sambai Lokanga did not impress, pushed to Crystal Palace. This season, Arteta owns the perfect central midfield pairing, Granit Haka and Thomas Party. But obviously, it's too risky to put all your trust in this duo. As soon as one of them has a problem, Arsenal's system will collapse. The name Jurgen Ho has long been on Arteta's mind. He was Pep Guardiola's assistant at Man City at the time when the club tried to recruit the midfielder in 1991 while at Napoli. After that, a couple of times, Arteta tried to approach Jurgen Ho but failed. This is the most suitable time for him to own the Italian star. Because, Jurgen Ho only has six months left on his contract with Chelsea. Thanks to that, Arsenal owns this player for only £10 million. In fact, Arteta has calculated quite carefully in the Jurgen Ho contract, not a spontaneous deal. Over the past few years, the Spaniard wants to build Arsenal into a young, energetic team. He very rarely recruits an elderly player like Jurgen Ho. However, this is a sensitive time. Arsenal have the upper hand in the race to win the Premier League when they are five points ahead of Man City, Arsenal played less than one match. So Arteta started moving towards experience. Not coincidentally, Arsenal's two signings in January 2023 were both aged. Before that, Leandro Trossard, 28 years old, arrived at Emirates. This view was echoed by the Arsenal head coach after signing Jurgen Ho, he is a smart midfielder, has leadership skills and has a lot of experience in the Premier League and internationally. It should be added that most Arsenal players are not familiar with the championship race. They were only forged under Arteta and didn't have many major wars. Jurgen Ho is different. The Italian players' collection includes a series of noble titles such as Champions League, Europa League, Euro 2020. The winning mentality is contagious. Someone who understands how to win like Jurgen Ho is of course necessary at a time of balance. It sounds cliché, but only when you are an insider do you understand what it means to be a guide. Jurgen Ho's success is something that even coach Arteta has never experienced to convey to his students. The fact that Arsenal only signed an 18-month contract with Jurgen Ho shows that they need this rookie for short-term goals. In the long run, they still look to Moises Cachado or Declan Rice to accomplish long-term goals. Mental aspect aside, Jurgen Ho is also Arteta's favorite midfielder. Arteta's style of play has many similarities with Pep Guardiola. Basically, they always need midfielders to make the ball. That's why Arteta thought about Jurgen Ho at the decisive moment. If you need proof, since the 2017-18 season until now, Jurgen Ho has four times, in the top eight, made the most passes in a Premier League game. Jurgen Ho's ball loss rate is just 12.8%, the ninth lowest among defensive midfielders in the Premier League last season. Simply put, give the ball to Jurgen Ho, you will be completely protected. This style of play is suitable in the Arsenal game that needs to be controlled, in both attack and defence. They will be relieved of the pressure. The minus point of Jurgen Ho is not reaching the best state after a sombre time at Chelsea. Anyway, a new chapter opens with Jurgen Ho. The problem is that Arteta will use this player properly. Arsenal like to buy over 30 from Chelsea. According to statistics, since 2015 until now, Arsenal have only recruited five players over the age of 30. 
three of them are from Chelsea, Petrasek, David Luiz, and Willian. In it, more or less they also have their mark at Emirates in a certain period.